Hi, this is Mike, and I'm with TabSite, and I want to lead you through the steps to adding the TabSite application to your fan page. TabSite is the easy fan page customization tool, and we have a free version, a $5 a month, $10 a month, $15 a month, and you also have yearly plans that you can select. Each of the plans has different features and options that increases with the uh, larger the plan. And in this case, we're just going to uh, install the free application, tab site application, to our fan page. So we're going to select free sign up. And that's going to take us to a page where the first thing we have to do is connect to Facebook. We have to accept some basic permissions so that tab site can know who we are, what fan pages we admin, that type of thing. We'll capture some account information, your name, business name, email address, and you'll move onward to the next step. On this page, you will then select the fan page that you want to add tab site to. So in step one, you want to find the name of the fan page, and um, it's going to have the little image icon pulled from your fan page. In step two, you want to select the plan. Is this the, the free, the $5, $10, or the yearly plans, that type of thing. You'll accept the terms and click onward to the next step, which creates your tab site account. You get a thank you message and a click here to start managing your tab site. We also automate a email that uh, gives you your registration information and some steps on how to get started. Uh, but let's proceed with getting started. To do that, we want to click to add a new tab site, that blue button right there. And this is going to name our tab. At the free version, we have two options, either tab site or welcome. In this case, we're selecting welcome. With any paid plan, you can custom name your tab, and then you hit submit to move forward. A uh, yellow box will appear that says you've not added tab site to your fan page yet. To do this, please click the next blue button, click here. That is going to open up a Facebook window, which will say add this tab, welcome tab, uh, to this fan page. And um, you just want to make sure that you select the appropriate uh, fan page to add the tab site to because each tab site is associated with one fan page. And so if it's selected the wrong one, you would not have content on that fan page that you've added via tab site. So make sure those are together. The right fan page uh, is selected to add the application tab site to and proceed forward with the blue button. This will simply add that tab to your fan page as shown here in the left side uh, area where tabs are listed. Then you can go back to the tab site manager. Again, that's at uh, www.tabsite.com. And in the upper right corner, there's always a login button to the manager. And then you'll click on the welcome tab that you've created. And now you need to click uh, add a page. Uh, every tab site has a content page associated with it. If you only have one page, that name doesn't show up, but if you had multiple sub-pages underneath your tab, then you would have a navigation for that. So in this case, we're going to name the page and hit Submit. That will bring us to the Content Editor, a simple what you see is what you get editor, where you can add text, bold, italicize, underline, um, add tables, add hyperlinks, add images. So let's proceed with using the Content Editor to add an image. We're going to click on the image icon on the right there. And one reminder as we go forward is that Facebook has uh, widths for the fan pages and heights. Um, the maximum width is 520 pixels wide, and the height is variable, but we recommend something about 800 pixels high if you want a full-size image. Uh, one image on your fan page, that'd be 520 wide, 800 high. So again, we're going to go click our image icon, which is going to bring up a, our image directory in tab site. We want to select first upload in the top right, and then browse. This is going to take us to our computer, uh, and we can find the image on our own computer. And once we've found that, we select it and then hit submit, which will upload the image to the tab site directory. And it will, we can click insert, and that will install that image onto our fan page. Our final step is to select save, and we're done. And we've published our.